All right, people. This is a little update. I haven't had an update in a while on my helmets I've made. But uh, as you can see right here, this was uh, this is the second helmet I have ever made. I made it out of the Papacure design. This one's just fiberglassed. I just repainted it to look better. And as you can see, there's not much. I didn't have a lot of detail. The Papacure uh, format I used didn't have all that detail. You had to glue it on yourself. And I never did. So I just wanted to show you this one. This is the back of Battle Damage. I repainted this one several times to look, you know, to make it look good. And, uh, yeah. Let's see if you can see inside. And, uh, yeah, you see the fiberglass inside. The visor, see-through. Uh, but uh, that's the one I used to make my molds with. And this is kind of what happened. This is a mold that I made. Plastic. It's all made out of plastic. And the visor's just kind of sit, uh, sitting in there. I had just got it in, so... But I added more detail. Oh, added more detail. Right there, the black part. Under here. I added all that. I cut that with a Dremel and then I just painted the inside. It looks just as good as anything else. Same as here. It's just more tedious work. Tedious work. But uh, here's the. Yeah, Saints. Go Saints, Super Bowl champions, yes. I am from Louisiana, so I had to make one for a buddy of mine. And, and this is this is actually I've had three pulls from that mold. And uh I had was making one, it was all painted just like this one, the Saints one, and I dropped it and it like shattered and I was so pissed. So I had to make another one. And here's another one. Actually, came out really good. See the max. It's got all the detail, battle damage. You know, there, got up there. You can see the plastic inside. Well, this one's a lot better. I did better battle damage on this one. Got a little carried away up here, but character I haven't drilled the holes for this one yet Let's see I'm gonna try to put the phone down and I'm gonna put the, the visor right here in this one so you can see let's see just uh, hang with me for a minute All right, sorry about that. I only ordered one visor for, for the time being. I'm gonna try to fit it in good to where it don't pop out. And this is what it looks like with a visor that's gonna be in it. Look at that, boy. It's not too many nice, you know, good work out there I mean oh there's a lot of good good helmets out there but for me not ever do uh, have done this before I did actually did pretty good I just want to note that some helmets I've seen up here it's almost like not tall enough for me you see how this one's got a little height to the, to the top of the, the round up here some helmets are like really they don't they don't round as, as high I don't know it's hard to explain I've seen some and but this one looks this model that I use is pretty accurate so yeah that's just an update on my helmets I'm still trying to I don't have time anymore hardly in school and stuff I want to make a whole suit I have a buddy of mine that wants to wants me to help we're gonna help each other make the suit but never got around to it but if you have any questions on how I painted you know like the stripes or or how I, how I uh, cut this this is actually the visor that was molded when I 
plastic, made the plastic, I just cut around and I made this indention, this extra. I didn't actually put this on there, it was just, this is plastic. But, sorry to, uh, kind of got off track there trying to put advisor in, but, yep. Just one more little detail right here on each side, and this one's done. I'll try to have an update of what it looks like with the lights in it. I have the lights, I just haven't installed them yet, so. Well, all right, people. Keep on making helmets, making costumes, do what you gotta do. And there you go. Peace.